Alright, I think that was everything in here. <clears throat> now talk to the witness. Finnegan Hood's cabin. Ah, you're here. Didn't think you'd have time to chat about trial old trials, you being the busy man you are. I'm actually here to speak about the current murder case. Oh? Why might that be? Did you see the death last night? No. You hesitated. Are you sure? No, no. I'm quite sure. There goes my first guess. Oh, guess I'll have to look for someone else. Sorry to bother you, Mr. Hood. Oh, don't go. You only just got here. I'm sure there's many things we can learn from each other. You wouldn't be here if you had anything else, anything else to go on, would you? He has a point. Okay, Mr. Hood. We can talk for a bit. Splendid. I'm glad you decided on staying. It's a potted plant. Nothing special. No hidden bugs or anything. This one really isn't special. Mr. Hood certainly has good taste in grape juice. It's an advertisement for a department store. Genius? Never heard of it. It's some Japanese place. We get a feel like the channels on satellite. I like watching them to remind me of our heritage. You're Japanese? No, I'm Irish American. Okay, I'm confused. What's your story, Mr. Hood? Why, Mr. Wright, I hope you can figure that out on your own. I used to be a defense attorney, just like yourself. What? Really? Yes, yes. That's why I took such an interest in the badge. Seeing these things make me feel a little nostalgic. What happened? Somebody accused me of forging some evidence. They disbarred me. The client disappeared, and I had to end up adopting this kid. That's... quite the tale. Isn't it? Had a bad client, I did. He screwed me over I took the rap for it. You probably couldn't relate. No, no, I definitely feel you there. Well, I hope you never make the same mistake I did. Pick the wrong guy, and you'll end up like me. I won't go into the details. But let's just say you shouldn't take evidence from young girls you can never met. Is this guy me in a past? Her current life? Hey, this is me blabber on one. Enough about me. What about you, Phoenix Wright? Something similar. Oh? That's so? Did you do it? Do what? A forgery? No, I was innocent. Oh. Good man. I did. Oh? Mr. Good! That's bad! Yes, yes. It was the coming. A fool's move. Can I do it again? It was the only chance of finding him not guilty. You'd do anything for a client you trusted, wouldn't you? If I thought they were innocent, I'd do whatever I could, but only by moral means. I know there's some who don't like what I did. You're not the first to try and set me right, and you won't be the last. I know what I did, so I'm not paid for it to be bad. I know a bit about Mr. Hood now, but it doesn't tell, it doesn't tell me anything useful. I should see if he knows anything about these murders. Yes, I know he just said he's Irish, but I can't do an Irish accent. Where were you last night? I was with the doctor. Neither of us went outside all night. Solid alibis for both. Can you tell me anything about either victim? Don't believe so. You said you were defending the neighbor, did you? So he's alive? Can you tell me more? No, no. Sorry. Ugh. Maybe he really doesn't know anything. We'll be on our way then. Don't leave. I'm sorry I can't ask about the victims. But there was a death here a bit earlier. Think this is the same? What, was it a month ago? A month ago? That sounds right. Do you suppose that this was related to the other one last night? I didn't think it was. Prosecutor Williamson said that- Trucy, wait. What? What did I do? Did you see what he's doing? He's been pressing us for information. Aye, I have. And thank you both greatly. 
I've learned a lot. They found two bodies, one from a month back, and they think they're connected. How much did you know before we came in? Maybe I knew, and maybe I didn't. Maybe I wanted to see how much you knew. Maybe I'm the killer. No, you aren't. Heh, <laughs> you're right. I must be a real dunce to admit that. Or maybe that's what I want you to think. You can't know for sure, can you? I'm not going to say anything about that. Might not. Or maybe I do. You'll have to guess for yourself. Curse the ambiguity. What if you just matter it all day? Yeah. Uh, you guys? Yes, right. Better not get- yes, right. Better not get too distracted. A speeder to medium? Take my advice to stay away from her. Not worth the trouble. I was been loyal to me since the day I met her. Oh, I'm sure. And she's dragged a whole boatload of troubles along the way with her, hasn't she? Well, no use denying it. The trouble magnets. I'm curious. But uh, better leave his life stories for later. I should probably look up what those are referencing. Did you see the murder from a month back? I, I did. Why'd you prove all it was? But, but you said you didn't. No, no. I said I didn't see the one last night. You tricked us. I, that I did. Weren't too hard, neither. What did you see? Oh, you're not the police, so I don't have to say nothing. Bring them in. I will talk. Do they already know about Mr. Hood? So looks like he's going to cooperate with me. If you all ask questions, I've got one of my own for you. Do you trust me? Do you believe a word I said? Excuse me? Simple question. Do you trust me? Maybe. You seem like a friendly guy. And yet a fool. You just met me a few hours ago. You know nothing of where I'm from. How do you even know a hood's real name? Is it? Yes. Yes it is. But why do you believe me when I say it? Don't put your face in me just because I invited you in for a little chat. Trust no one, son. Not in this business. For all you know, I brought you in here to kill you and your little helper. Did you? Would I be daft enough to say if I had? Let go, Phoenix Wright. Keep what I said in mind. I'll see you later. Unless the client is found guilty. Well, that was awkward. I'd better get it going. Do you think we're prepared for the trial? We'll see. There's some pretty solid evidence, but... You don't know who the suspect is. Right. We haven't had a chance to meet him. Can we please try the detention center again? I really feel we shouldn't be handling a case without knowing who we're defending. Things aren't that simple. The killer almost killed Maya before. After what she just went through. Menderes won't give up. I have to know what happened here. We'll try the detention center one more time. Thank you, Daddy. Guard, is he still in questioning? I told you it would take a while. Hold your horses. Jeez, who peed in his cereal today? I wasn't kidding about it taking the whole day. I wonder what's taking so long. Having a clue. Uh, well, we tried. Huh? The door won't budge. Uh, it won't? We're trapped in here? Um, hello? Can somebody let us out of here? Who is it? Hello? Are you blocking the door? Maybe. Maybe? 
I'd really prefer not to be trapped in this room. Yeah, well, you're not getting out without my say-so. Who are you and what do you want? Are you Phoenix Wright? What do you mean, am I Phoenix Wright? Of course I am. Prove it. Prove it? Slip it under the door. Prove I'm Phoenix Wright, huh? Take that! There, you happy? Yep, it's that same stupid badge. You're him. Stupid? I should have known. It's her again. Are you followed? Miss Porter, what are you doing here? Shush. Did I know you came? Does who know I came? You're the one who stalked me to the detention center. If there's a weak leak. It's you. I know nobody followed me. Can't touch this, Spikey. I put the sneak in incognito. But there's no... Shut up! After you exposed me last time, the whole world found out I'm a spirit medium. Can you imagine how many people would kill me for that? Do you need my help with something, or are you just going to spew nonsense? A bit odd, this one. Ah! They followed you! Get down! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Take it easy! She's with me! I'm his daughter! His... his daughter? Spiky, who are you... why are you here? A mutual acquaintance wants me to deliver a message to you. You're really in for it now. So, pretty cool, huh? No, it's about as tacky as your stupid hairdo. Hey, note this in the badge. Your badge sucks. Phew. Knew it. Maybe she knows something about the wiretaps. Okay, guess not. Fine, I'll just talk to you. What was your message? You have to solve a case for me. Can it wait? N no! No, it can't wait! I'm already in the middle of something. Williamson recruited me for his current case. You did? Yes, and the trial starts tomorrow, so if you don't mind... Wait... Wait, you're defending? I am a defense lawyer. Spiky, what the heck? I can't believe you'd think that low. You were expecting me to prosecute, maybe? Oh, shut up. Why do you even come here? Are you going to deliver your message or not? Forget it. I can see whose side you're really on. Why are you so angry? Spiky's gone over to the dark side, that's why. I can't believe you'd let Beardo recruit you into this. I don't understand anything you're saying. Don't even. Change my mind. I don't need your help. Glad he's put her out, jerk asses. I'm glad that's over. A bit unusual, that one. Do you still want to do this? It'll be fine. I seem to recall Apollo not meeting one of his clients until the trial. Yes, but... But nothing. I know what I'm doing. I'm sorry, that was harsh. I need to do this. Be careful. Don't do anything you'll regret. 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 I'll only regret it if I fail again. That can't happen. That can't happen. I'm in this mess. The killer is involved. The Ravala's family also has their hands dirty. It can't be good if they're working together. What's going on? Well, I guess I'm stopping it here.